all corners of the county have to succeed if the county is to succeed. And part of that success is having access to the amenities and the opportunities uh, in your own community. And certainly that is true in South County. When I think about this project, I think back to early conversations with Supervisor Highland well over a decade ago about the need for an animal shelter and the need for a police station somewhere in South County. And originally those concepts were talked about along the Route 1 corridor. And as Lorton grew and, and more and more people moved to this part of the county, it was very clear that this area is where the new station needed to be in order to make sure we could maximize our police resources and be efficient as a county in delivering services. We've been looking, working a long time to improve the police presence and response time in this area. It's tough when you have had two different stations that have served this area, and if you, you count the other areas that will be impacted by the addition of this police station, there'll be a across the board improvement in response time and support. We also have an animal shelter, which is, I always say, on the other end of the earth, uh, at least from respect to, uh, to Mount Vernon, on the other side of the county, uh, that has really not served this part of the county very well. And we have an opportunity to change that with the animal shelter. And this second facility really will create a win-win for all of us. So we look forward to engaging with the residents of South County for the many animal programs that we will offer programs that will support keeping families and pets together, and programs that will provide access to much needed resources. I really hope that this becomes a hub. Um, again, thinking about community policing, thinking about community, a sense of community, a sense of place. I hope that this new police station co-located with an animal shelter will provide an opportunity and a community room will be here for people to come to engage, to have discussions, to meet those who are the heart of a building are the people who will work here. When you look at what we're doing as, our, as, as Fairfax County and as our team, um, we've gone through this pandemic pretty well. We've gotten great leadership from our Board of Supervisors. We've gotten a lot of work done by our team. And as you see, it culminates with this groundbreaking today. We talk about the environment, lead silver. We talk about efficiency as co-location of services. We talk a good game and we deliver a good game because that is how we do it here in Fairfax County. And I think we will be continue to do that as we move forward.